Hi learners! Welcome to grade 2 class. It's me again, Teacher Frel, your class advisor. Are you ready to begin a new school year? How do you feel now that you are in grade 2? Let us enter the world of numbers in this level. The learner visualizes and represents numbers from 0 to 1,000 with emphasis on numbers 101 to 1,000 using a variety of materials. Gives the place value and finds the value of a digit in 3-digit number. Lesson 1. Place value. Ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. Today is our first day in math. Our first lesson is about the place value. Kids, do you know what is place value? Place value is the value of each digit in a number. It is important that children understand that whilst a digit can be the same, its value depends on where it is in the number. Like for example, the 6 in 460 represents 6 tenths or 60. However, the 6 in 6,800 represents thousands or 6,000. Let's see the place value of this given number, 28. The digit in the farthest right represents ones. In the number 28, the 8 is in the ones place. It represents 8 one cubes. Next to ones is tens. In the number 28, the next digit is 2. The 2 is in the tens place, means 20. The number in the tens place is always 10 times the value the number shown. It's like counting by tens, means there are two groups of 10. Let's count by 10. 10, 20. It represents 2 10 cubes. 2 groups of 10s and 8 ones. 20 plus 8 equals 28. We write 28. Let's add digit to this number, 28. If we put 3 next to 10s, how do we read this number? Write 328. If 8 is in the 1's place and 2 is in the 10's place, what is the value of 3? Correct! A 3-digit number is in the 100's place. In the number 328, the 3 is in the 100's place. Means, 300. Add 2 zeros to make it 100's. The number in the hundreds place is always 100 times the value the number shown. It is like counting by 100s. It represents 100 cubes per group. There are three groups of 100, two groups of 10 cubes, and 8 1 cube. Means 300 plus 20 plus 8 equals 328. We write 328. Now, let's add some more digit to this number, 328. If we put 1 next to hundreds, how do we read this number? Write 1,328. If 8 is in the 1's place, then 2 is in the 10's place, and 3 is in the 100's place, what is the place value of 1? Correct! A 4-digit number is in the 1000's place. It is equal to 10 hundreds. In the number 1,328, the value of 1 is 1000's. 1 is in the thousands place means 1,000. Add 3 zeros to make it thousands. The number in the thousands place is always 1,000 times the value the number shown. It is like counting by 1,000. 
There are one group of 1,000, three groups of 100, two groups of 10, and eight ones. 1,000 plus 300 plus 20 plus 8 is equals to 1,328. We write 1,328. Each digit in a number has its place value. Let's put 1,328 in this chart. Ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. The place value of 8 is in ones. The place value of 2 is in tens. The place value of 3 is in hundreds. And the place value of 1 is in thousands. Can you try to answer the place value of this given number? 25. What is the place value of 5? And what is the place value of 2? Correct! 5 is 1's and 2 is 10's. What about this number? 3,678. What is the place value of 6? And what is the place value of 3? Correct! 6 is 100's and 3 is 1,000's. Give the place value of each underlined digit orally. 342 What is the place value of 3? 658 What is the place value of 5? 904 What is the place value of 4? 4,562 What is the place value of 4? 2,389 What is the place value of 3? 3,452 What is the place value of 3? 4,875 What is the place value of 7? 2,194 what is the place value of 4? 6,472 What is the place value of 6? 8,790 What is the place value of 7? Let's have our activities. Read the following numbers correctly. the underlined digit in each number and write its place value in your notebook. Example, 265. The underlined digit is 2. 2 means hundreds. Keep pause this video. Write the following numbers in your notebook correctly. Keep pause this video. Remember, a three-digit number is in the hundreds place. The digit at the farthest right represents ones. Next to it is tens and next to tens is hundreds. A four-digit number is the thousands place. The place value are ones, tens, hundreds, and thousands. Let's answer this problem solving. Aling Maring bought a large number of mangoes in Sambales province. She bought eight big baskets with 100 pieces of mangoes in each. 
She adds six more small baskets with ten pieces of mangoes in each. Then she adds four more pieces to eat for her travel back home. If she bought eight big baskets of mangoes, six small baskets of mangoes, and four pieces of mangoes, how many mangoes does she have in all? Let's take a look of this illustration. There are eight big baskets with 100 pieces of mangoes each. Six small baskets with 10 pieces of mangoes each. And four pieces of mangoes. Eight one hundred is equals to eight hundred mangoes. Six ten is equals to sixty mangoes. Four one is equals to four mangoes. Therefore, the answer is eight hundred sixty four mangoes in all. Let's have again our activities. Write the place value of the underlined digit in the given numbers. Write ones, tens, hundreds, or thousands. Write your answer in your notebook and keep pause this video. Write the following words in figures. Kids, always remember! The place value are ones, tens, hundreds, and thousands. The digit in the farthest right represents ones. Next to it is tens. Next to tens is hundreds, and next to hundreds is thousands. Kids, I hope you enjoy our lessons today. Continue to learn numbers. Soon, you will surely love them. Until our next topic, bye-bye kids!